Right guys, so we've got uh, Fong's car back on the dyno. Had some problems yesterday with the fuel pump. It's got that all changed out now, ready to go. You get a new one in there, Fong? Yes, sir. Should we make some power? Yes, sir. Woo! <laughs> Let's get this little hot rod popping. That's it. Got the new fuel pump installed and uh, we're right back where we were we just did the cam degreeing and uh, we're gonna go ahead and make a rip and see where we're at <laughs> it out and it doesn't take oh dang it it's hard to get knowledge when the dyno acts like this and we've noticed it more on just naturally aspirated really high tone cars or like stuff that uh, just makes a lot of big power ah. Can't see. <laughs> Girl, my, my eyes. Look at it. Jesus, can't see. So good, I'm crying. Look that door up. Look at Jamie's eyes. <laughs> He's crying, dude. <laughs> it's just such a beautiful sight. Nope. It's frustrating though, because you're trying to get this done and you didn't get it. I can't beat that. Uh, well. All we can do is try again. Maybe it needs to be in the box more. Yeah. I have to look around here, but you have to tell me. It wouldn't even turn the green light on. Yeah. Ah. It's struggling on the front half, yeah, especially. So we'll, we'll check those cam adjustments again and go from there. Yep. Need more? Maybe. 
just go the other go back where you were go back or at least go back to zero i'm not sure i don't see this working if it even feels lazier If I have like two and a half degrees, so I'm gonna bring it down like around. Bring it back to zero, cause it made more at zero. Yeah, the blue ones yesterday and the green ones today with the cam adjustment. All right, so now we got a picture of the cam adjustment. Fine. Okay, so yeah, we were right. We need to change that up. We we're better at zero. Hey, Fong, you wanna see this? See what, see what you're up against? So the curve very much looks the same, but look at the, yeah. Split, you know. Well, here it's the like, green ones from today, the blue ones from yesterday. They look at 90 miles an hour, yeah. 30 mile or 30 horsepower. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. So we'll just check the cams out again, and then we'll. Check <laughs> on the bottom it got closer up top yeah yeah should we just zero them see what that does or, or yeah 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 whatever fong let's let okay. fong make a decision and i'll just keep tweaking on whatever he decides okay fong what do you think do you want to zero them or what it meant it kind of shot the middle between yesterday and the first one today okay i think the problem because on the exhaust cam Okay. So I'll bring the intake back to what it works and try one more time and see how it goes. Okay. Yeah. That one 304? Yeah, that was 304. That wasn't the 308? No, 308 was yesterday. Oh, okay. But it was more power throughout the entire range. Oh, so what did it make? Oh, 304 was this one. So the green one was the run a little bit ago. The blue one was yesterday. The red one was just now. So... It kind of shot the middle. It got closer up top, but. finger in it? No, not yet. Oh yeah, that's I, not fun. That, yeah, good. At least I'm not the only one then. Your friend is ready. Voila!
on the right track 318. now. 318. Yeah, dog. Now we're feeding it. Keep going that way. Yeah. Don't worry. You guys won't drive forever. <laughs> First, you guys get a new deal. <laughs> on the right track now. Sometimes we need to step back to move forward. That's sometimes you step back to move forward. That's just how it goes. Okay, so that was a positive change for sure. So, now you're going the right direction, brother. Yes, sir. I'm gonna flip this, all right. Just took a little bit of effort and uh, losing those couple pulls and then the fuel pump yesterday just kind of slowed us down some. That's how we learn. That's how we learn and we're on track. So, good work. Yeah. I mean, I would just subtle changes, and then when we get back from Houston, we can really dive in and get it precise because we can put the degree wheel on it, and we can get our split the way where it's supposed to be. So, I think that's a good course of action, and uh, should be able to do that pretty good, pretty quick. Well, we got another 80 horsepower to read our goal, but we gotta do that. Yep, 80 horses our goal. I think if we can peak out with this fuel, then we can, we can put it. So everybody was asking what stuff is in it. It is on methanol, uh, 70 millimeter ITBs, um, BMF cams now, and uh, what pistons are in it? What what uh, brand? JE pistons. JE yeah. pistons. And then the 14 to 1 compression pistons uh, are at our elevation though. You almost lose a point of that compression because we don't have air up here. So that is also something considering to consider when you're watching the videos and stuff. And the old engine was only 12 and a half. Yep. Yeah, the old engine was, was 12 and a half. half. Yep. So it was more like 11 and a half. Yep. But he did just get this all together, got it in the car. Um, there's obviously, we have some stuff to do when we get back, um, just to optimize things and get it as far as we can go. And then um, once we get this as far as we can go, we're gonna add a little nitro. And those of you that are asking about uh, the Phoenix, um, there's a whole nother engine program going together for that and it's gonna come together um, and it's gonna be super special, but we gotta put funds together and we gotta get our ducks in a row. Um, in the meantime, you guys are gonna get to see us blast in this one, which is uh, no slouch in itself. And this one isn't coming apart. Yeah, this one isn't coming apart for that car. Cars. Yep, yeah. yep. The other one we wanna do some just really fast nitro stuff and go into and dates. The car's safe to do that. Yep. This is safe for what we're doing with it, but to go crazy, yeah. the other one is We wanna put this into the nines. That's kind of our goal. Yeah. And then the other one into the eights. If it's not in the nine, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We go there. Yeah, we're just doing everything we can. We're just having a good time. And it's this fun watching you build it. Yeah, this one's fun. You can try stuff. I worry it's not about as expensive. I worry about night seven. It's easier than from the night to the eight. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> from the ten to the nine, it's more easier than Yeah, that's for sure. <laughs> So he'll rotate this and get it back at TDC, which is top dead center. He'll make his cam adjustments and then he'll run through the lash again. So every time you've, he's done this, he's run through the lash every time. Um, the numbers we're gonna put in there this time are eight and eight and uh, see if we can't make a little more stink. All right, so Fong made another gear adjustment. Um, he kind of went the way I asked him to go. So. We'll see if this one will work. Um, what I want to do is probably get the tune up pretty close and then we'll take it to Houston this way and then we'll come back and then we'll have a, we'll put the degree wheel on it and I'll, and I'll help him degree the cams where they need to go and, and where the split should be. And then um, hit this all again. But for right now, Let's go.
on the right track. Every time he shuts the door, he shuts me in. Ah. 321. Not bad. Definitely on the right direction. Yeah. Once they're degreed, they're gonna be. Yeah, so maybe we'll just run in this direction and then yeah. I guess still gotta add a little fuel to it. Yeah. Just tune it in what it is and then yeah, we water it, it is. later. Yeah. Yep, exactly. <clears throat> but the fact that it's wanting more fuel means we're on the right track. Yeah. Because it's because this got cam, more this cam is more fat than the other one. Yeah. It's kind of hard right there between retarding and advanced. So. And then by the time we get back and then weather is warming up, whatever it is, right. we spend more time with it. But you can we, see the progress. The right yeah, yeah, we're going yeah. the right direction. Yeah. So right track. Yeah. that's what matters right now is yeah. we're going up and up. Yeah. And uh, like you said earlier, sometimes you step back to go forward. Yep. We step back. We now know mm -hmm. that's not the direction. Go this way. And uh, the results are definitely showing. So awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Rip this bitch. <laughs> Come on, baby. Three, three, three. <laughs> Give it to us, please. Way better. All right. And uh, we're definitely going the right direction on the cam gears now. It's looking excellent. We definitely have more in the cams. We're not nearly done. But for right now, with the race coming up or the event coming up this weekend, uh, we're going to call that good. And then when we get back, we'll run through the, um, the cams again and see if we can't get to his goal. And if we don't if we get close, We'll add a little go juice to the fuel <laughs> and then it'll really do it. So yeah. <laughs> it's coming. Just hold on. <laughs> Here. Okay. <laughs> there. We see the red light. Okay. All right, guys. That's it for today. So, uh, part three coming soon. So, uh, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know if it's good or not, but. Should right, be one good. More. Right, one more. Remember how I made you made me do it all over and over one time? Yep. All right, guys. It's kind of hard work for today. So that's it. So uh, part three coming soon after the Creedison Car Houston. So uh, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Don't cry, Todd. It'll be okay. <laughs> Fong will be racing tomorrow too. It's just the fuel. <laughs> 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 there, that's more like it. <laughs>